A tear-filled reunion of sorts this week at Offutt Air Force Base, but this was not your typical military reunion. This one involved a man and woman who had never really met, except for the day he saved her life. Her daughter took to social media to track down the mystery man she calls a hero. One Facebook post led thousands to help complete her mission, a face-to-face -face meeting so she could say thank you. 3 News Now reporter Miranda Christian has that touching moment. My savior. How are you? I you have no idea. It's a meeting filled with emotion. I had to. Three people now share a connection that will last a lifetime after Dwayne Page helped save Norma Huff's life. Because of you, my mother will have more pages to turn in her life. Last week, Huff had run to the Offit commissary, but her blood sugar dropped so low she couldn't even make it out of her car. How close do you think you were to going into a diabetic coma? When Paige saw Huff in her car, he didn't hesitate to help, calling 911. So, if it wouldn't have been for you? The thing was... I'm just glad I got to you. Huff had no idea who Paige was. Her savior had disappeared. So am I. She told me that a gentleman in a red t-shirt and a ball cap found her. And her daughter, Sam McKinney, took to Facebook, reaching out on the Bellevue 411 page, searching for the needle in the haystack. He saved her life. He saved my mother's life. She's found and determined she was going to find him. And she did. The tears between the three hold a special bond. Here's a little piece of my heart that I baked for you okay. because you have a heart. Paige is now the family's hero. I try to, uh, I try not to use um, the word hero too much. It's a, it's a heavy weight to carry. I just feel I was your, the average person just doing, doing something helpful for somebody else. He is a hero. I don't, I don't think that my mother would be here today doing this interview if not for Mr. Page. A stranger going out of his way. Thankfully, he was there. Huff says she is doing better this week. Page says he now has someone to add to his Christmas card list this year. This next lifesaver has four legs and a cuteness factor that's undeniable. These adorable pups belong to Christy Brandt, who runs Cashmere Goldens. But these are no ordinary golden retriever pups. They have a very lofty goal to comfort those going through tough times. Three from this litter will go to Lutheran Church Charities Canine Comfort Dogs, an organization that travels the country bringing comfort dogs to mass shooting scenes and natural disaster sites. The Friday night lights will soon shine bright at high schools across the nation as football season kicks off. For seniors, it's a bittersweet season, the culmination of a high school career, but an exciting one too, as they prepare to move on to the next level. Each year, the Omaha World Herald selects the top six senior players from Nebraska and Western Iowa to make up the Super Six team. Omaha World Herald visual journalist Matt Dixon takes us to the photo shoot. This year's theme is Big Fish. Same thing? All right, here we go, guys. One, two, three. One, two, three. Uh, the Super Six. No, it feels great being the best players in Nebraska, you know. It means a lot, you know, being actually recognized as the top six in the area. Uh, I think it's a great honor, you know, come out here, take a picture. I mean, he had me sit on the whale and I got a little wet, so that feels good, yeah. Just because I like to pancake people and make my presence known. I'm pretty quick off the ball. My moves, I like to swim a lot. I like to swim a lot of people. Bull rush, you know, that's my strength. And, uh, I make plays. I'm a playmaker. That's what I do. Four games last year, I scored on the very first play. I say speed and uh, my weight. I'm 300 pounds running a you know, 4'8", 40, so I can get to guys in a hurry. And, I guess I try to be physical like a bear, you know. I'll probably say my speed. So I'll say about I'm a cheetah or so, whatever. Yeah, so they're fast, quick, can change direction real quick, and I feel like that's what I can do well. I mean, I expect myself as a big cat, I mean, lion or a tiger. They're the main predators around, and 
they get the job done. I'm a gorilla, man. Planet of the Apes, that's where it's at, definitely. One of those gorillas. A lion or a gorilla, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, I like gorillas, uh, you know, they're big, you know, strong, you know. Or like a little monkey, you know, because little monkeys, they could have a whole, like, job career. They do all sorts of stuff. I could get some rich person by me and I could chill in a mansion or something. That'd be pretty cool. Yeah, be a little house monkey. Little house monkey. Huh. Great shots, Bo. All six are set to play major college football. Two will stay in the state, joining the Huskers next fall. Omaha Sunday Morning continues after this.